Hi everyone, welcome back to Sugar Mama TV, your financial coach, counsellor and creator. This video is an update on the $1,000 project and uh, a bit of magic that happened along the way. Now if you've watched my video on how to manifest money, um, you know that having a really good headspace is so important in, in attracting and building, I guess, more financial opportunities for yourself. If you want to expand and grow, you need to do it on not just a financial level, but also on a personal and spiritual level as well. And uh, so having a really good mindset is essential. When you realize the amazing potential that exists within yourself, powerful things can happen. You start to be, you start to operate from more, a more harmonious and a more creative place. And incredible things can start to happen. It's like the universe senses that you are doing something that's really positive, not just for yourself, but for the other people around you. And it's like the universe like gives you a couple of favors or gives you a couple of amazing opportunities to help you um, with your, you know, your amazing focus and determination and um, drive. So in doing this um, $1,000 project, I've become, you know, I've really loved doing it. And it's funny, like I haven't had the desire to go shopping as much. I haven't had, you know, and now when I do buy things, I really question the value and think, oh, what I, do, I, do I really need to buy that new top, you know, for $100? Maybe I could put that money towards the $1,000 project that I'm working on. And I've just, it's really made me sort of question my spending habits and really look and, at what I buy and if I really do value and appreciate it. And, you know, I'm really enjoying working on this um, on this project. And initially, I thought I was scratching my head thinking, oh my goodness, what have I set for myself? This might be really hard to achieve. But it's actually, um, things are happening really quite easy, easily. And the universe has definitely sent, you know, an amazing um, helping hand my way. Because the most random thing happened. Um, I was going through my mail, um, you know, just had some bills and, um, you know, some newsletters and so forth. And... I got a credit card bill and I looked at it and it said nothing was owing on it and it was zero and I just threw it in the bin. And as I was walking back into the house, I realized, hang on, I don't actually have that type of credit card and I'm pretty sure I saw something about it being in credit. Anyway, I went back into the bin, fished it out, opened it up and as it turns out, I apparently had been in the past randomly transferring money onto a credit card which I no longer have. I actually had it cancelled years ago. And accidentally, the credit card company was still accepting payments even though the account was closed. So what the, led, what the statement was actually showing me was my account was in credit by $800. So after many phone calls and going into the bank um, and speaking to someone, eventually I got a check in the mail for $800. And initially I was like, oh great, I'll just put it on my mortgage because I hate debt and I'm trying to pay off my mortgage as fast as possible. But then I went, actually, no. I, this is magic. This has happened. And I'm so excited about doing the, the $1,000 project with everyone and showing them how easy it is to attract and manifest parcels of $1,000. The universe has just done, done this for me. So I'm going to put this $800 towards my uh, the $1,000 project. And then another couple of funny things happened a few days later. I bought a skirt and a top, but it wasn't very expensive. I think the total bill came to $130. I was showing my girlfriend, I pulled it out of the shopping bag to show my girlfriend who was over for dinner about what I'd bought that day. And she quickly pointed out the skirt had a hole in it. So I took the skirt and top back to the shop and said, look, it's got a hole in it. Can I get it swap, swap, swapped over? The girl said, I'm sorry, sorry, that's actually the last one in your size. We'll have to refund your money. Initially, I was like, okay, no problem. You know, that's a pity. And then I realized, oh my goodness, that's another helping hand that the universe has given me. I'm going to put that $130 that's being refunded back into my account towards the $1,000 project. And then I took some change out of my purse and also put it. So I then quickly, within a couple of days, manifested $1,000, which is going to be invested shortly. So what I'm trying to say is when you're really passionate about something and it's serving others and you're, and you're going to inspire others, um, you need to open up your mind and realize the opportunities that come your way. And as I said in my, money, uh, my video about manifesting money, even you know, noticing a $2 coin in the street, as silly as that sounds, stopping and showing appreciating for that, you, know, you get more of what you appreciate and um, the universe likes to, send, um, likes to continue on doing those things. So... Um, I wouldn't if I hadn't actually stopped and realized how amazing that was getting a check in the mail for eight hundred dollars. You know, it would have just gone to my mortgage. I wouldn't have probably appreciated it as much. But I get to share this with you, and hopefully, this inspires you to realize other opportunities that the universe sends you, in maybe putting towards the, starting your own investment portfolio and growing your financial wealth and independence.
So that's my little update for you on the thousand dollar project. Um, I'm really excited and um, that you know I hope you're following along and as I said in my initial videos if you're doing stuff even if you're in the middle of uploading pictures on clothes that you're putting on eBay make sure you hashtag the, the one thousand dollar project. We'll be regularly checking your um, the hashtag accounts and, um, and it's so good to be able to share with other people how you're actually building um, and coming up with extra money that you can put towards the thousand dollar project. The other day I had an amazing um, conversation with a girl um, on Skype and she actually started house sitting to earn some extra money so that she can do the thousand dollar project and start building up her own investment portfolio. And she's, she's having a great time living in amazing homes and looking after beautiful animals. And she's you know using that money to put towards the project so that she doesn't have to change her lifestyle in any way. Anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, I hope some magic happens in your world and I'll see you in my next video soon. Ciao for now. Bye.